Hi, my name is Casey. Um, I grew up in a really small town in central Illinois. Uh, I graduated with 42 kids. Uh, it was a super religious town, but my household was not uh, religious. I grew up not Christian, not really anything. Didn't know who God was or what God even was till I was eight. Um, my parents just kind of raised me like, follow the path that you want and we'll support you no matter what, which I'm very thankful for because it led me to Jesus. Uh, one of my good friends from back home, his name is Zach, he asked me to go to church one Sunday because he needed to talk to me about something. And I was like, oh my goodness, like, do we have to go to church to talk about that? Like, why, what, what? But I was like, okay, it's fine. Like, yeah, we'll talk on the way. And I went and I was like, okay, like, I'm kind of interested, but it's a lot of like elderly people. So it's a lot of backstories that I didn't know, like, you know, all these things. And I was like, I have no idea what you're saying. I don't know what this word means, like stuff like that. And I went the next week and I was like, Zach, I don't know. I'm not grasping anything that's happening. Like, it's just not filtering into my head. And he said, read Romans Road. And I was like, I don't know if that is, but okay, if you tell me what it is, I'll go home and read it. So he gave me all the Romans passages that I was supposed to read. So I went home and highlighted them and it was late at night. I don't know, like, like it was dark outside, super late. And I read Romans 10, nine. And for some, I don't know what happened. Like, this is why I know this is true. But like, all of a sudden I just started sobbing and I was like, Oh my goodness this is real like this is why things make sense this is why everything in the world is the way it is like and I just cried out to Jesus and I just prayed so hard I was like all right like I am yours like take me like take all of this that I've been struggling with like please 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 help me like get me closer to you like and I don't know that's when I was like woo! and then I was on like a Jesus high for like a week and it was great uh, Journey has played a big role in especially in my college life because I got here and I tried out a few different churches and kind of like back at home like no offense to the church but I felt super I felt judged I was like I'm not Christian enough I'm not I don't know these things um, I don't know these backstories like I've done things that like some people will never do in their life things like that and uh, when I when I came to Journey it was extremely accepting it was like, you know, if you're not Christian, this is how this applies to you. If you are Christian, this is how this applies to you. And I was like, I've never been to a church where they talk like that, where they talk to both sides of the spectrum. And so I felt super welcomed. And that that's what made me want to get closer to Jesus last semester, which was when I was like, you know, I need to go to Journey every single week because these people will speak to my soul. Like they know, they know what this is like. Like I know how, I know what it feels like to be not Christian, and I know what it feels like to be Christian. And so the fact that they can reflect off both sides of that for me is like extremely helpful. I want to be baptized today because since I've struggled with the whole identity thing, for me, this is a huge, huge step in saying publicly, I am a Christian, I do believe this, and I am not afraid to take this step because I've been afraid for so long that I wasn't going to be good enough or, you know, if I was baptized and the people who aren't religious weren't going to like me anymore or vice versa. But I was like, no, this is what I believe. I want to follow Jesus. I love Jesus. Like, Jesus loves me. Jesus loves you. Like, and I want everybody to know that. And so, yeah, that's why I'm getting baptized today. I would like to thank Emily for coming today and traveling all the way from Evansville and for always being there to support me, always having my back no matter what, no matter where I was on my personal spectrum. I'd like to thank my family for coming who drove six whole hours to get here, my mom, my dad, and my brother who are in the crowd today. I'd like to thank all of you for coming and I'd like to thank Journey as a church because they're amazing and you know, thank Jesus because hallelujah. <laughs> My name is Casey and this is my journey. <laughs>